are you? Why are you doing my house? You're not allowed to be. What do you mean? Why are you doing my own house? What's going on? What makes you think this is your house? What? I like this living room, by the way. This place is beautiful. It needs some cleaning up, too. But that's okay. I'll clean this place up in no time and soon. It'll be spotless. What are you talking about? Stop this right now. Tell me who you are. Shh. You are a curious one, aren't you? This is insane. I won't call the police. Come on, Noah. We both know that the police are not to be trusted. Wait. How do you know my name? Tell me. How do you know my name? Wait. Do you hear that? I think someone's watching us. They always are. You're not the only one. Oh goody! The fish and chips are ready. What? Enjoy your meal. So Noah, tell me about yourself. I study. What do you study? Counting. <laughs> Numbers are silly, just like you. If you're gonna mock me in my own house. Then you should just leave. You keep saying that this is your house? That's because it is. I wake up in this house, I leave this house, go to the university, come back to this house, and do everything in this same house. Therefore, it is my house. But one day, I wake up, poof, I can't leave this house. I'm currently eating fish and chips, and there's a stranger sitting in front of me telling me that this isn't my house. This isn't your house. Huh, <laughs> can't believe this. This must be a dream. You're not even a real person. Thank you for the meal. Did you not just see or even hear what just happened? <laughs> it just fell from my head. It broke. Don't be silly. Nothing can break in this house. What do you mean? You know something, don't you? <laughs> What's so funny? Nothing. It's just so cute how you talk about owning this house when you know nothing about it. That's it. I'm done. You're, you're crazy. You need to get out of my house right now. I can't. <laughs> What do you mean you can't? If you can enter my house, then you can leave it. <laughs> I just can't. Get out! Fine. Fine. I'm going. Yeah, good. See ya. Bye, Noah. See you never. See you never. I still think you're lying by the way. As I said before, if you can enter my house, then why can't you leave it? Noah, for the hundredth time, I just can't. You can't leave the house and neither can I. So basically, I'm just stuck in the same situation as you. I would have believed you if you didn't act all creepy and stuff. <sighs> just let it go and show me to my room, Noah. This is your house anyway. Fine. Um... You can sleep in the guest room over here. It's preferred that you stay here throughout the night and stay as far away from me as possible. Ha <laughs> ha, very funny. Okay then, good night. Good night, Noah. I'll see you tomorrow. I hope not. Oh, but you will, child.
Wake up. Wake up. Wait, man. Whoa, who are you, man? I don't have a lot of time. I need to listen to you. What? What are you talking about, man? Get away from me. You can trust me. The woman is the one who is dangerous in this house. She's luring you to your death. She needs to be the others and know she's doing to you. What? I don't understand. Meet me at the kitchen tomorrow when it's bedtime. I'll be waiting. Bedtime? Why are you talking about, man? Wait, hold up. Don't. Shh. I see you are trying that stun again. Well, you must open the shot. Actually, you haven't told me anything about yourself. <laughs> no, child. I'm just an old widow withering away as life goes on. You were married? I was, yes. What, what happened? Mother and nature happened. My husband was on his way to work. Lightning struck and a tree fell on Gloomy's car. And just like that, I was alone. Well, I'm very sorry for your loss. Um, I actually lost someone too. This is my mother. She left just a few years ago. She got a heart attack. Well, we don't have to worry about that now. We should just put the past behind us and be hopeful of the future. Oh goody, the fish and chips are ready. Breakfast? Uh, um, no thank you. I think I'm going to head upstairs and rest for the day. See ya. Jeez! Wash! Don't be too loud. You don't want to hurt your hearers. You want to leave this place, correct? Yeah. Figures. All of them do. You mean there were others? How many were there? I've lost count. What do you mean, lost count? What happened to them? Murdered. By her. Come, I'll show you. This is it. The backyard door. That's what you think it is. She used to bring more than one person into this house. Sometimes there were two, three, all thinking the same thing. All thinking that this 
was their very own house. We were all strangers to one another, but we couldn't escape, and so we have no choice but to live together. One night, I woke up hearing noises downstairs, and it sounded as if someone was dragging something across the carpet. I saw the woman dragging the body of one of my housemates across the hallway, and I saw her throw the body out of this door like it was nothing. Then she say, Naughty children gets punished. And I never saw that person again. Naughty children get punished? Why did she say that? That's because they tried to run away. How are you? How do you get away? I just hit. That's all I've been doing all these years. Living silently in the walls. It's locked. Yeah, she locks it with the key. Do you know what the key looks like? Noah, is that you? What's all that noise about? Hey, uh, I was... I couldn't sleep, so I was getting some water from the kitchen. Mm, okay, but it's getting late at night, and I think it's best if you should go back up to sleep. Oh, right then. Good night. Good night. Long time no see, Mike. Something, Noah. I can't help you if you stay quiet. You should kill them. It needed to be done. Mike wanted to leave the house. And worse, bring you along with him. Mike was being naughty. And naughty children get punished. But that's not excuse to kill him! But I didn't do it for nothing! I did it. Get away from me! You're a murderer! There's no need to shout now, my child. Everything I do, I do it for you. My only purpose is to protect you because it is not safe out there. We will be safe as long as we stay inside. Get away from me! And stop coming, your child! I'm not your child, and you're not my mother. Chips are ready. Where are you going? I know there's a way to leave this house. I know that you have the key. And? If I can find the key, then I get to be free. And if you don't? I promise to never try to run away again. But answer me this first. Is the key somewhere in this house? Yes! Is the key somewhere on your body? No. 
is the... Uh, uh, you suggested a simple game, not 21 questions. How about you find the key to freedom and five minutes? What? That's impossible. Wait, you can't do this. For dinner, we're having fish and chips tonight. Really? Yes, dear. Am I going to pay my friend after dinner? I've told you before that it is not safe out there. Mommy only wants the best for you. And in order to do that, you need to be safe. And how do we always make sure that we are safe? You need to stay inside. That's my baby. Okay, can you please put out the fork and spoon? I'll be downstairs in five minutes. Okay, mommy. 